Welcome back to more Ace Attorney. We were in the middle of the investigation on day two. We have Emma here just chilling. Emma, what do you have to say? What what do we do? Well, where should we begin? Oh well, isn't it obvious? We should begin with that, you know, that thing. That the the mystery of the victim, I guess. How could one man, Detective Goodman, be killed in two places simultaneously? Oh, well, you see. We should go to the police department, the evidence room, was it? <laughs> uh, I'm not being very useful here, am I? Sorry, I just keep talking over you, fucking Phoenix! <laughs> Let her speak for five seconds! <laughs> Let the baby speak! No, no, you're being very helpful. <laughs> She's so sad now. Why did I do this? I must say hi to Charlie, though, at least. Mm. Mia's plant Charlie for taking care of him in Maya's absence. Huh? No. He looks a little yellow today. Uh oh. You've been over watering! Oh, I watered him just now. I mixed in a lot, too. Um, oh, guys, kill what him. What did you mix in? Mix in <laughs> what? <laughs> Why, my very own scientific additive. Well, Charlie, do you like it? Uh, he's I dying. I told you, he's turning yellow! <laughs> You're killing him! You're killing Charlie! <laughs> it's okay, Charlie lived forever. I know, right? <laughs> uh, Meekins. Let's talk to Meekins. What does he have to say? Yo, Meekins! You don't oh, have anything good, new to say! Okay. <laughs> I, saw, I heard you clear your throat, too. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure we're fine with that. Um... I could always try to go back to... I forget where we left off. I mean, they said the evidence room, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. going back to the police area. Where the fuck am so I what, going? Yeah. Here. Security guard. Is he here? No, he's not here. Can I then go into the... Get... Nope. Hello? Should I... Knock, Should I pull knock. The guy? Probably. Probably. <laughs> while, while I fuck around and find out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have the ID card from Chief Kent. I forgot about that! Oh, yeah. I forgot. I thought she was going to say, like, well, we can't do anything, but... I'll just give her this since I oh, yeah. said that one already. Just open. Um... <laughs> it won't open. Aha! The card reader's turned off, see? What is that security guard thinking? I mean, he's turned it off, he's got a trap laid out in front of him. <laughs> Prepared. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> <laughs> Howdy, partners. Well, well, what's made my Bambina sky so gray? There he is. There's yeah. the man. The king! <laughs> <laughs> Officer Marshall. Somehow, I knew. <laughs> How'd you know, Nick? I would never guess. What's that somehow I knew look for? As it's kinda hard to miss a cowboy. Surmise, this here's my saloon. Um, we're here to investigate the crime scene. Uh-huh. Yeehaw! That card you got there on your chest. That's better than a sheriff's badge in these parts. Yeehaw? Ye and dare I say it, haw. They always say yeehaw. <laughs> But they never ask call ye. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> well, what are you standing there for? Get along, little doggies. Crime scene's awaiting. Oh, looks like the card reader's on again. Over here, I was wondering if we could ask you some questions. Sorry, cowboy, but I got no mind to tangle with you, hombres. You're busy, then? Did I say that? I only said I didn't wish to speak with you. Actually, you said you had mo no mind to tangle with us hombres. <laughs> <laughs> you have to add that. <laughs> I have, if I say Spanish words as Phoenix, I have to mangle them as terribly as I can. I love it. <laughs> Sound as white as possible. Hombres. Hombres. Hombros. Hombros. Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, I was wondering if we could talk to you. 
Sorry, oh, wait. I, am I just remembered. Huh? We have the lunchbox. Yeah, we have to give him the lunchbox. I just wanted to see what he said. <laughs> but I'm off to roam the lands like a tumbleweed on the wide prairie. Like a gunslinger loading his six shooter, I say a little prayer. Whoa. <laughs> Is that oh. his stomach? <laughs> <laughs> what was that all about, Mr. Wright? I think he was just too hungry to talk. <laughs> You're just saying that because his stomach was growling. I mean... <laughs> you have no idea what he was talking about, either. Well, in any case, we need to get cracky on this investigation. Pronto! Okay. <laughs> He'll probably do the same thing. Yeah, I think he will, so, uh, I got you a lunch. It's from me, not your, uh, girlfriend, question mark? That smell. Ugh! That reminds smell. me of Texas! <laughs> Salisbury State? The heart of Texas. <laughs> the stars at night are big and bright. <laughs> so, Officer Marshall, you're from Texas? He's gonna be like, no, I'm from Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I just saw a special on television the other day. Is this from my baby? <laughs> uh, yeah, Miss Star. Wh what's this? What? What's wrong? A uh, filet steak lunch. I see. I see! <laughs> I don't see. I wonder what it means. It's a steak lunch. I gave it. <laughs> Here, have this. <laughs> oh, excuse me. No! What you, what you doing over there? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Alright, Bambi. Was flipping out for a second. Was it? <laughs> God. Ask him anything. I don't know what they're <laughs> Finally, it seems like. He's willing to talk. Ah, finally. As he's stuffing his mouth full of steak. <laughs> march, march, march. <laughs> Officer Marshall, you're in charge of security for the evidence room, right? <laughs> it's Woody from Toy Story. You got good eyes, partner. It's an easy job, and I'm grateful for it. Actually, Officer Meekins at the detention center told us. Ah, that poor little doggy. Poor guy, I keep getting his name wrong and calling him Meekly. <laughs> he told us something. He said that when the stabbing occurred, you weren't at your station. Oh. Well, maybe I shouldn't be telling you this. Since I got demoted from Detective two years ago, well, it might not look it, but I lost my fire for the job, you know. So, what were you doing around 5.15 when the murder took place? Well, I reckon I was galloping down the highway on the back of my steed, Zippy. <laughs> no, he was riding down the highway on his horse named Zippy. <laughs> his horse. There's no need for people here, anyhow. These new fangled machines do a bang-up job of keeping an eye on the place. You mean the security camera system? I don't take much, much that I don't take to machines much. Kind of like that stewed broccoli they sneak in next to your steak, you know. <laughs> okay. I feel okay. That. <laughs> <laughs> that star told us something. She said you were a detective until two years ago. It was always my dream to be a raw high wrangler on the scene of the crime. That's all gone now. Like drink like a drinking hole in a prairie fire. You're still investigating the SL9 incident with Miss Starr, aren't you? <laughs> that was my case. It's all solved on the record books, but it smells like a bad game of poker. I can't let it go. That's all there is to it. What kind of case was it, anyway? We've heard the name so many times, but no one tells us what actually happened. 
There are some things you're better off not knowing, Bambina. Anyway, that case is officially dead as of two days ago. Two days ago? The day of our case! That's right, the evidence transferals. Edward was talking about the transferals too. Hmm. Flashback? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> we don't need a flashback for this. I know what maybe two of the machines in here do. But only two of them? There must be a dozen! <laughs> Why do you work here? <laughs> like I said, Bambina, me and machines, well... I like them about as much as I like stewed cauliflower with my steaks. The easiest ones to understand are these here security cameras. Those are the ones that Officer Meekins mentioned. If nothing happens, the tapes are automatically erased every few hours. And Officer Meekins and Detective Goodman, are they on one of those tapes? I reckon they might be. You're the security guard and you reckon? <laughs> 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 one more thing. When you go into the evidence room, you need an ID card. Thus the card reader by the door. The card reader leaves a record of every ID a card passed through. Who's straight sevens? <laughs> <laughs> 420. <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> so this is the ID card record. Hey, I've seen that somewhere before. Oh. Sorry, Bambina, I can't show you more than that. Huh? Uh, oh, excuse me. <laughs> I haven't heard whether this is related to the case yet. I would think it is. <laughs> Mr. Wright, I saw a number on that record just now. I've seen that number before. Matt, how are I'll you? I'll waste a Oh, whoa, Mr. White. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's some way I can prove that the record is tied to the stabbing. Hmm. Sorry, but could you please explain what this whole transferal thing is about? I swear to god, transferal should have another R in there. <laughs> you too, I <laughs> He's shaving infinitely, please stop him. <laughs> He's gonna start shaving his skin. <laughs> oh god, no, please don't. No, his hair grows <laughs> back indefinitely. He has to keep <laughs> shaving it to keep it from growing into a full beard. <laughs> it's like, it's like, um, rats and rabbits and with their teeth, they have to keep, like, chewing. <laughs> <laughs> or else they grow forever. <laughs> we keep only evidence from solved cases in this room. They're kept here under the presiding detective supervision for two years. So we can reinvestigate them if it turns out there was a mistake, see? So what happens to the evidence after two years? It goes to sleep forever in the underground vault at the police station. That's what we call transfer. We'll do it every February. February. I see now. <laughs> Transferal's like a funeral for old cases. Two years after a case is solved, it's closed forever. Dead. Never to be reopened again. Never to be reinvestigated. That happened to SL9 two days ago. Hmm. Eh, hmm, eh, hmm. Mm, hmm. It's a new stream, it's a new day. Let me present this to you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the sheriffs back in the Wild West didn't place much faith in evidence. Not the only thing they trusted was their shooting hand. Um, okay. is there, this is neither wild nor west here. Wait, I, I thought you were in LA. I was gonna say, if we're in LA, we're pretty west, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Aha, uh -huh, but that and this are two different things entirely. I guess so? Huh? I'm lost. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we need some evidence to get anywhere with this guy. Uh... Does this work? I mean... He is the evidence man. Yeah. Hey, you. Oh. Okay. 
Ah, we don't trust our shooting hand. Yeehaw! What the hell does yeehaw mean? <laughs> <laughs> I'll explain to you later, Emma. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Maybe we should try entering the evidence room? Maybe we should. <laughs> we should yeah. do that first. Can I, like, push the button over here? Beep. The evidence room is beyond that door. I turned I on sure the card reader. Is. Go have yourself a ball, partners. <laughs> Oh, sorry. And I have the ID card. A real ID card. A real ID card? <laughs> Let's get this investigation started already. Alright, Phoenix, fine. I just went in to look. <clears throat> oh, we've never been in here yet. Da, 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 da. We're in the evidence room. It's spooky in here. <laughs> it's quiet. The investigation must be over here. So this is the evidence room? It really is kind of like a graveyard. Graveyards are supposed to have grass and trees. This feels more like a morgue. <laughs> nice try, Mr. Wright. Y you can't scare me. <laughs> oh oh god, he faded in so quickly, he scared me. <laughs> 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 Alrighty. Good point. Nice talk. Oh, I thought you were a ghost. <laughs> I mean, he kind of faded in like one, so like. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend going around smacking ghosts on the head, pal. So is it okay, true what I heard? Did... How did she smack Gumshoe? I had cannoned him to be like six five. <laughs> she just jumps out. <laughs> <laughs> like they, you know I, how you like hit a I door. I like to believe she tall, threw something at him. Smack it. <laughs> Actually, why is there handcuffs stuck to this door back here? Listen, don't <laughs> worry about it. it <laughs> I'm gonna worry about it. Um. <laughs> ah. Oh, oh. Righto, please! Do I look like a selfish man? Heck, if anyone asks me, sir, can I borrow $50? I give them $50, no problem! So go ahead, investigate that room to your heart's desire. Knock yourself out! Yeah, it's true. So, Chief of Police Gant will loan anyone 50 bucks? Even me? <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, oh honey. so that's what you are talking about. Actually, I was put in charge of the investigation for today. Just for today? Just for a day. <laughs> but guess what? You got permission from the Chief, and now you're boss for a day. Gee, thanks. <laughs> First of all, you want to have this. Oh boy, floor plans. Thanks. Oh, look at those, real fast. Hey, gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. That sure is a room. Wow. What <laughs> <Or> an L. <laughs> what an L. Judge for a day. You get the L, you're doing the alphabet. <laughs> so, Detective Gumshoe, your boss for the day? That's right! It's an honor! After all, the murder took place right here in the police department! But, if you're a boss, why are you all alone? Nobody will listen <laughs> to me! Where are your underlings? <laughs> They're using They're our home. findings from yesterday's investigation to prepare for the trial. In other words, Detective Gumshoe got kicked out of the investigation again. Oh. I'm out of it, though! I'm going to take control and put this case to rest! And in my own evidence locker, pal! You have a locker in here too, Detective Gumshoe? Ha! <laughs> of course! I am a detective after all! They gave me a locker that I, only I can open, pal! Only you can open? <laughs> knock knock. <laughs> <laughs> I'll always believe in Mr. Edgework no matter what happens. So, Mr. Edgeworth is with the Inquiry Committee now, right? They're trying to figure out who's responsible for the mess up in the court today. I see. I guess this is what, this is what you call fate. Mr. I don't know Edgeworth, about that. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth just can't get away from that case. That case? The DL6. 
No. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, oh, in that case, the S L nine incident, of course. You gotta swap uh, out for the other. That was the course. beginning of the end for Mr. Edgeworth. We even get us to tell we even get him to tell us more about the case. Hmm. This place is more high tech than you might think. Every locker's fixed, so only one detective can open it. Using this ID card? Well, that's the thing, pal. ID cards can be lost. Like the one we found on the floor. <laughs> well, I'm on my third card since entering the forest already! Oh god, come shoot. Um, <laughs> oh, that's not good. <laughs> that sounds like a lot. Like, imagine if you lost your credit card. <laughs> <laughs> this is my fifth credit card I'm on now. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, but even I can't lose my own right hand! That's what you think. <laughs> right hand? Oh, you mean your fingerprint? Exactly, pal! The lock for each locker's code with the fingerprint! Beep. And that's the only locker we can open. It's kind of like an extra trench coat. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, they look like normal lockers. These are the latest model! There's a trick to the handle, see? The handles? On the other side of the handles is a sensor, and if the wrong person touches it... <laughs> Zap! You get a shock. If that's what happened, my hand would would be black and smoky every day. <laughs> oh, gumshoe. Oh, honey. <laughs> in any case, the locks aren't that obvious. There's even some people in the forest that don't know about the fingerprint locks. Mm-hmm. Important information. <laughs> I'm gonna take a moment to look. Hmm... What's some interesting things we can look at? Like, the locker! Hey. <laughs> <laughs> this place is stuffed with evidence. Stuffed with dreams. Dreams. <laughs> I'm not so sure about the dreams. Maybe nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> the one open. <laughs> Guess I should've known. Hey, pal, our security is high-tech around here. I know, you told us about it. Alright, what the, what the hell is this? What's this? Blood? It's a well, little it's more, but there's definitely a handprint here. It's a footprint. <laughs> I thought you said the blood was warm. I was like, oh, that's terrifying. Uh, like, it was warm? Run. I've been so concerned. <laughs> Looks like someone tried to wipe it off. Mr. Wright! What if there are other blood stains left in the room? <gasps> oh, you got the blue light thing. Uh. We should use our testing fluid to check it out. Well, I'm gonna finish looking at everything, but yes. Someone left the glove here, but only one. Hmm. Sent to Gumshoe, maybe? There you go, pal, making me out to be some kind of absent minded detective. You kind of are. <laughs> <laughs> That's evidence from the case, you know. You mean SL9? It does have a tag on it. Rubber glove. Maybe I'll use it. Paint? What is a song paint doing here? Since the dawn of time, true art has always been a war against oppression. True <laughs> <laughs> art? I noticed that there's blue and yellow paint here. <laughs> oh, no. Perhaps oh, we're no. witnessing oh, the birthplace of the blue badger? <laughs> well, you might say this is my studio. Oh, honey, oh my Here, god. Here? In the honey. evidence room? What if he, like... <laughs> like, taints some evidence? I know! <laughs> He's, he painted the blue badger and made it here. I... oh my god. Oh, he got kicked off. <laughs> wow, someone must have broken something big to make all these pieces. <laughs> like a wall. Took the gumshoe, <laughs> perhaps? <laughs> there you go, pal, making me have to be some kind of hooligan! That's apparently from the case. The case? Can we just go through SL9. this? SL9. You know, the SL9 just... incident. You know, I just said that earlier. <laughs> See the sticker on one of the pieces? Do any of you listen to me? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna check it out closer. I wonder what shape these pieces were in before whatever it was broke. You want to try to put it back together? Yeah. Heh! <laughs> Good luck, pal. That's no job for amateurs. Well, I spent a good three hours on that before I had to give up! Bruh. <laughs> That's why I always carry around a tube of glue. Never know when you need glue. 
Well, this piece looks like the bottom. Let's try putting the rest in place. Getting flashbacks to the, like, the technically the second case in the second game. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about that. Ah, oh, puzzles. Oh, I love puzzles. Alright, let me see all the pieces. What goes where? No. No. Wait, this one. Oh, wait, that. Pink. <laughs> uh. Oh, there's blood. Oh. Uh, no. Oh. Not jagged enough. This is more of the top. Yeah. No, I have to go back. It doesn't loop, that's so dumb. I know, right? I thought it would loop. <laughs> <laughs> This is bullshit! Oh, that looks- that looks- Yeah! Yeah! Alright. Um, the other- there was another piece. Uh, there it is. Oop. Wait, wait. Yep. I'm solving this faster than you guys can keep up. It's funny. <laughs> uh, no, uh, I don't think so. Uh, I don't that's know like what this lip. is supposed to be. No, 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 no. It's a vase. I'm so confused. Yeah? Yeah, that one. Yeah, this one. I think- uh, I think it's a vase. It's like a weird looking thing. I don't remember what this is specifically. I think that, yeah, the, it goes like that. Yeah. Like, go back, go back. No, 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 no. Oh, what? oh, oh, well, oh. No, Why are you yelling at me for? I know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> Your brain is just too big. I'm sorry. My there. brain meat is huge. Wait, 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 wait. Put it back, put it back, put it back. One more time. Yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, you, no, I no, don't think no. so. <laughs> no, rotate it 90 degrees. Yeah, no, no, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> okay. wait. Turn it one more time. One, one more no, time. Turn it. <laughs> there you go. I swear to God. Oh, I see what was confusing me there. Wait, is yeah, that? Pop that bad boy in. We seem to be missing a piece. This puzzle's incomplete. Turn art. <laughs> huh? Oh, <laughs> I was like, where is everyone? <laughs> Well, I think we did it, but some of the pieces are missing. Hold on, I'm cracking my bones like an old man. <laughs> this is a quick ASMR bone cracking stream, it's cool. <laughs> he failed at art class. That only took me two minutes to do, the problem is finishing it! Were some pieces stolen? Hmm. I bet they were missing to begin with. Uh-huh. Still... Doesn't look like the most stable kind of jar. I kind of understand how it got broken. I just got flashbacks to how I think this case wraps up. <laughs> Ooh, baby! Unstable jar. I forget what the hell that thing even is. <laughs> what the I don't fuck remember is either. I just remember the stuff about the missing piece, and I was like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> look, this one's open, and there's an indicator tag stuck on it still. It's an SCP. Oh no. That locker is coated with Detective Goodman's fingerprint. Detective Goodman's locker. <gasps> Are you sure it's okay to leave it open like that? I mean, he's dead. <laughs> well, it'd be hard to get it open again if we closed it. <laughs> it's empty. It must have taken the contents elsewhere. I mean, yeah. You would have to, wouldn't you? What the fuck is this door? Wow! Look at this big pile of junk in the corner! <laughs> it looks like a car door. There's a pair of handcuffs attached to the frame. You know how it is. Maybe the guy they caught was some sort of escape artist and he got away. Hey, that's one of those human profiles for range testing. He's been shot square in the forehead. Better him than us. Yep. <laughs> sure. I, I sure, uh -huh. hope, I sure hope so. Is that a sweater? There's something sticking out of here. Looks like a shirt. I guess it must be evidence for some case. I wonder if Detective Gumshoe put it. this here. <laughs> there you go, pal, making me out to be some kind of slob. <laughs> I'm not responsible for the evidence here, that said. I bet that evidence locker was opened recently. How do you know? If you leave things hanging out like that, the evidence gets dirty or ripped. Guard checks on that kind of stuff when notifies the detective responsible. How many times have I had him break breathing down my neck about some silly evidence? 
Sounds like Detective Gumshoe leaves evidence hanging out a lot, too. <laughs> Betty doesn't tuck in his shirt under the trench coat, either. <laughs> Just really going after him today. If you're gonna talk me at someone's back, don't do it right in front of him, pal. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Gumshoe, I love you. <laughs> Some sort of bulky equipment is gathering dust here. Oh no! Oh. <laughs> What's the fishing pole? Sorry, look fishing pole that is. <laughs> oh. Ah, that's my personal pole. <laughs> I never did get around to using it. Lord. Oh. <laughs> I've seen that somewhere before. Right, pal. That's the metal detector. The one that led to the solving of that case in Gord Lake. Remember? All right. Wow, that feels like it was ages ago. It really does, honestly. <laughs> it's been a while since we played that case. And uh, hmm, I don't think I've seen this one before. Oh, that—that's a radio locator. I'm sure it will come in handy in solving some case sooner or later. Well, which case? That cheap-looking box. I don't remember this thing. I I remember that. I don't remember which I, case it's for. I feel like it's important at some other point in another game, but I don't remember where it comes in. You can't judge a person or a machine by their cover. You gotta look at their heart! <laughs> Doing Gumshoe's voice hurts my throat. <laughs> <laughs> it hurts mine hearing it. <laughs> uh, I think that's everything. We looked at everything? I think we have. Can I talk to him about anything? <laughs> I'm not looking at him. <laughs> oh yeah, we need to do the luminal. Oh yeah, the the, the thing that 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 the. the, the... <laughs> Allow me to say one thing. Speaking as a detective, if I see a piece of evidence I know nothing about. I say nothing, nothing. Hmm. That's fine. <laughs> you bet it's fine, pal. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, we we don't go to the court record. Oh, maybe. Uh, do we just use it in here? Oh, spray! I spray Gumshoe in the face on accident. <laughs> oh, oh, blood! Is there any other blood? Hey, hark, 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 hark. No. <laughs> I see you trying to use commands in there. <laughs> <laughs> there must have been a massive amount of blood here. I've never seen so much before. I'm not a professional. What's your opinion, detective? Hmm. Pale blue blood. <laughs> oh my god. A troll has died here, I see. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Vulcan. <laughs> it's the fucking robots from, uh, uh... Uh, Connor and whatever the fuck his name is. <laughs> Detroit Become Human. <laughs> I was trying to remember oh, the name of the game. No, no, <laughs> not that game. <laughs> the only good part of that game is when you fail random <laughs> quick time events. Like all of those games. Here's a quote from Martin Luther King. <laughs> God. <laughs> uh. It's symbolism! He shouts with a <laughs> megaphone on top of the roof. <laughs> Look! They are slaves to humanity! Symbol! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Detective Good was actually an alien! <laughs> this proves that something really happened in front of this locker. Hmm. I'll make a note of it on the floor plans. Hey, you didn't want my opinion, you shouldn't have asked! <laughs> well... <laughs> well... Be smart. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Oh. Uh, I did remember correctly. Like, 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 like. Whoa! <gasps> Why am I getting a reaction here? There's no reason for the murderer to touch this spot if he fled out the door. Uh, this might be something significant. Hey. That's some pretty amazing stuff you got there, pal! What? This? It's called luminal testing fluid. 
Where'd you get your hands on that? Huh? I'd like to get some too! <laughs> I'll just borrow 50 bucks from the chief! <laughs> oh, honey. <laughs> Where'd you get this, Emma? I always buy it by mail order. Well, I better jot this down on the floor plans. Scribble, 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 scribble. Is there anything else? You might need to do that one blood stain again. This one? Yeah. Click, 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 click. Hand! I knew it. This is someone's right hand print. What? What's the matter, detective? Th this locker is mine! Oh, it's yours? And I. Uh, <laughs> Please! You have to help me when they come to take me away. Promise you'll testify I wouldn't harm a fly! You'll do that for me, won't you, pals? This is an important clue. I'll tell on the floor plants. Nick, you didn't reassure him that you would testify for him. I'm counting on you guys. Believe me, you can't trust the police. But you are the police. Fuck the year detective! Gumshoe said fuck blue lives. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else, is there? Uh, yeah, no, I don't. Yeah, it doesn't sound like this. Uh, okay. Can I present some shit to you, I guess? Like, uh, glove? And then also maybe the evidence lock. I see a piece, piece of evidence. Of... I know nothing about it. I say nothing! Okay, that's... You all. Alright. <laughs> okay. Uh, Gumshoe is no thoughts head empty. That is true. Oh! <laughs> you can't open the lockers if your fingerprint doesn't match. You can open it. I'll give you 50 cents! No. The police department lacks faith in its lock system. <laughs> Erg. Hmm. Hmm. Ugh. After all, Detective Goodman was stabbed here after opening his locker. At the same time, he was found dead over at the prosecutor's office. Uh. Oh god. <laughs> Let me look I at think these. we've presented everything. Blood! There's blood all over the floor, and it's blue! <laughs> you are dead. Uh... I think we have presented everything we can present to him. Look how cute he is, I love him. <laughs> <laughs> He's just a big man, and I love him. Uh... Alright. To... Should we try talking to Edgeworth again? I guess? Because the last time we went there, he wasn't there, right? Ah, true, he wasn't there. Uh, let's go. Da, dun, 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 dun. Oh god, you, I forgot you were here. <laughs> oh, god. Karen. Karen, no. Ah, oh, fuck, he's not oh. here. Oh, is he here? Oh. I got excited for a second. Did we miss something then? Because I'm looking at the guidebook. We probably missed something. Hmm. That's usually what happens. Oh, we need to present the ID card record. Um. Uh, <laughs> we had that? Um, yeah, I think so. ID card record. I didn't think we got that. Oh. Oh, he just showed it to us. We didn't actually get it yet. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, hold oh on. we need to present hold Goodman's the fuck ID on. to right. Marshall. <laughs> May Marshall! <laughs> We're idiots! Look at this! See this? <laughs> this is a victim's ID card. Wow, we, you, you were like, wow, we need to connect this somehow. <laughs> then we just Fucking, didn't. <laughs> we just left. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's the the one that was on the ground in the parking lot. Need to find Marshall's voice again. Number on this is 5842189. Officer Marshall, show us the ID number on the ID card record. <gasps> we can see. Oh, -ho! oh! Look, the fourth number. It's a perfect match. Unlike sevens. <laughs> there. <laughs> It was used at 
514, right before the stabbing. <gasps> What's more, there's only one of them cards in the world. So, when the incident occurred, Detective Goodman was in the detective room. Hmm. But wait, what did Officer Meekin say? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Oh god! <laughs> oh, Lord. So you asked Detective Goodman to show his ID card, what did he do? That's what they accidentally pointed a knife at me! <laughs> <laughs> I love Tomodachi Life! <laughs> That's what it sounded like, huh? <laughs> he had his ID card then. Why would he have pointed a knife at Officer Meekins? Because Doug. Because Bruce Goodman was really. A bad man. Oh. <laughs> All right, compadre, you win. I guess I can give you this ID card record. Woohoo! We got it. I have got an idea. Maybe I should show this list to other people with the with IDs here. <laughs> Thank you, Nick. That's exactly what we're doing. <laughs> Come to. Could you take a look at this? This is the ID card record of the people who came in here on the day of the stabbing. <laughs> I heard the rumors! I can't find Gumshoe's voice! What happened? Whoa! <laughs> I missed that entire text box. I wasn't looking at the screen. What, what is it? The, 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 that second number! It's not your ID number, is it, Detective Gumshoe? Mr. Edgeworth! <gasps> what? Oh. The second number on this list belongs to Mr. Edgeworth! What? 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 I swear dun, to God, dun, if like, Edgeworth dun. loses his job over this, I'm going to be so upset. I'm not, <laughs> <the Ace Attorney. laughs> I'm not saying anything, but. <laughs> <sighs> I'm, I'm going home. <laughs> Nice Don't worry, he guys. doesn't lose his job. <laughs> he gets demoted, doesn't he? No. <laughs> what why, the would, hell? why would Edgeworth come to the evidence room? <laughs> That's oh, something you'll find it. out in Justice for All. Nay. <laughs> Does he go to jail and see a murderer? No. Why would Edward be a murderer when he's Phoenix's husband forever? <laughs> I don't know. I learned that Phoenix becomes- well, I can't say because spoilers, but like, you know what Phoenix becomes. I <laughs> yeah. got spoiled for that. I'm so upset. Does he say anything else? I heard the rumors and blah! Okay, now it's just the same thing. <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I guess we gotta go talk to Edgeworth and ask him why. Uh, why? God, God damn it. God damn it. I just went back to the. God damn it. <laughs> I hate this system of walking so much. Department entrance, and then I gotta go to the parking lot. And then I gotta not hit the court record. I gotta move, <laughs> and I go into the high prosecutor's office, and he's still not here. <laughs> Did we miss? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> hold, hold, hold up. Time hold to find up. your edgy boy. Hold, hold up, I'm scrolling. Edgy uh, maybe boy. Maybe I should. I'm gonna present the thing to her just in for fun. Hey, look at this thing. Take a look at this. Ah. Oh, right, right. Yeah, it's you now. <laughs> you? You get to voice Oh, it. okay. Yes? You didn't present Goodman's note or the switchblade uh, knife to gum to. Uh, <laughs> you said you wanted some hot tea, right? Uh, no, but thanks. You didn't even look at it. I figured. You must have to breathe leaves a long time to get rich flavor like this. <laughs> Oh, pre yes. infuse the leaves with some steam before brewing. How's what? I knew it! So that's the secret to their aroma! Exquisite! Exquisite! 
The only thing I'm smelling here is wasted time. You're right, Phoenix. <laughs> Let's get out of here. <laughs> I am back to the department entrance. And then I gotta hit move again. And I gotta go to the security guard office and hit move again. And I gotta go <laughs> in the evidence <laughs> room. Oh, I'm so glad that in Professor Layton versus Phoenix Wright, they went with the Professor Layton way of moving around the map. <laughs> I would lose my mind if I had to use this version. <laughs> Gah. Put the knife. Oh yeah. Found him, Mr. Edgeworth car. Stabbed him with Mr. Edgeworth knife, huh? What would drive Chief Prosecutor Sky to do such a thing? Hmm. Well, well, well I didn't mean... I mean, I'm sure, of course, someone else really did it. Someone who must have, uh... Someone who must have, uh, got a grudge against Mr. Edgeworth. Yeah, hmm. How about this? Uh... Hector Goodman's note. Not switchblade knife. I bet Edgeworth was the most surprised of anyone. Because of the SL9 connection? That was Mr. Edgeworth's first big case, you know. Two years ago. Smooth talking there, dick. <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. That was the first time in the world New Edgeworth was the man to be feared. But why would evidence from that case turn up now? I guess it's not over, pal. Maybe there are some loose ends left on that case. Hmm. Anything else you need to talk about? Oh, uh -huh. there it is. That was a bloody violent case. The more you move, the more you exercise. Ugh. <laughs> Maybe Phoenix needs it. <laughs> Phoenix, get your legs going. I need bikes everywhere. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> He doesn't skip leg day. <laughs> Violet, so it was a murder? A serial killing! Oh god. A serial killing? Maybe I don't want to get involved in this after all. But the killer made a mistake, and Mr. Edward built his case around that to nab him. And this was two years ago? That put Mr. Edward right in the spotlight. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Started the rumor mill. Rumors. About forged evidence? It was supposed to be uh, all cleaned up with the transferal the other day. It was the last job he ever did. Detective Goodman, that is. Huh? What do you mean? Detective Goodman was a detective in charge of the SL9 incident, see? So, mm -hmm. so, a switchblade knife. The victim took the knife out of the event locker himself? Hey, pal, look at the time! Is there something you need to go be going to do? It's just that Mr. Edgeworth inquiry committee should be letting out soon. Ah, oh, finally. <laughs> what? How, what is that? <laughs> I'm gonna go give him my report for the day. What? Gumshoe, what are you holding? <laughs> I, I really wish I knew. <laughs> it might help oh, I, I, th I think that's the... <laughs> um, that's the flyer for the French dude. Oh no! <laughs> I oh, remember what you're talking uh... about. <laughs> but report me the note written on the back of that flyer. Sorry, I was so distracted by the flyer <laughs> that know, my brain I just it shuts off. Yeah, the one that says nothing but no problems. <laughs> hey, it's Mr. Andrew we're talking about. I'm sure he can use a report like this. I believe in him! Who needs enemies when you've got friends like T Detective Gumshoe? <laughs> I'm off, pal! Later! Oh, fine, I can start, stop doing that voice. <laughs> should probably see what Edward has to say, too. Uh, I'm out of water, no! <laughs> I'm gonna have to go get more. I'm gonna move all the way to Edward's office and then stand up and go get more. I did it again. I fucking did it again. I keep doing that. I believe in you. Ah, uh, I can't read. <laughs> well, now you finally get to talk as a character after forever. <laughs> All right, give me a second. I'm gonna get water from the bathroom. <laughs> All right. The, the bathroom? It's right there. <laughs> Alright, never mind. Alright, near me. Ah. <laughs> uh, 
See ya. I miss Garrett. <laughs> I can't believe Garrett. he's already dead. <laughs> Sometimes I still hear his voice. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> Don't don't tell Garrett, but I pulled up Miles <laughs> Edgeworth's <laughs> wiki page because now I'm I'm determined. No, don't do it. No, no. no. Should I close it? I'm I'm at the early. I'm at his first trial thing. Should I should I just close it? Yeah, don't. Okay. You don't want spoilers. It's a wild ride. Oh god. <laughs> Oh, shh, be quiet, he's back. <gasps> oh. Or I, I thought he was back, I heard rustling. That might have just been one of us. <laughs> I wanted to make it look like we were talking about him. He'd just come back to, like, that sentence and be like, uh, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> and we'd be like, mm, nothing, what are you talking about? <laughs> Jamed once again. It's a Garrett. Him. I returned and I spilled water on myself. That was quick. <laughs> the bathroom is like right there, like next door. <laughs> I said I wasn't judging. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Didn't accuse you of judging. Oh. Whoops. You think I would just do that? Judge my own friends? I, I said never that weird. <laughs> just put okay. <laughs> Whatever. <Hey. laughs> <laughs> Back in the high prosecutor's office. Oh, now with him. Oh. <laughs> what? Huh? How? <laughs> oh. Um, well, I think you did his voice when we first moved. I don't remember, though. Oh. Alright, well, I'll just give him the worst voice imaginable. <laughs> oh, yes. My apologies. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's you. Have we met somewhere? No. Huh? Mr. Edger, I beg your leave. So long. <laughs> and there he goes. So long. Is Edward here? There, standing by the window, a teacup in his hand. What is this, a novel? <laughs> <laughs> Looking forlornly out the window. <laughs> ah, it's you. He has the hotel Brigham tea service. Mr. Edgeworth, you're back from the district prosecutor's <laughs> office inquiry? Precisely. By the way, Detective Gumshoe was looking for you. Oh, yes. He brought me some information, it seems. <laughs> this fucking flyer. Information in quotation <laughs> marks. <laughs> really? Was it helpful? Apparently a new French restaurant is opening near here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think he was trying to console me. Somehow. <laughs> uh, oh, look on his face. I think the report is on the other side, Edward. Does no one know how to turn over a paper? No one in this game can turn over a fucking piece of paper. <laughs> oh, Mr. Edward, I think this whole thing is really taking a toll on him. We don't know how to turn papers upside down. We don't know how to flip them over. Everyone's oh, talking stupid God. in this game about These paper. These are lawyers. <laughs> Look at you! <laughs> I love him. Come here, Miss Come here. He's giving noises. <laughs> so, how did the inquiry committee go? Actually, they decided not to treat this case as a as a case. <laughs> Actually, they decided to treat this not as a case of concealing evidence, but. As a communications error during the investigation. Mm -hmm. Concealing evidence? Yes. Apparently, there are some who believe that 
I can see all the evidence. Mm. Uh oh. They gave me a warning. You were lucky this time. Again. Uh, again? I've heard them say that so many times. Ever since that case two years ago. Uh, oh boy. Uh, uh, oh no. Are you okay for the trial tomorrow? Well, I'm still the presiding prosecuting attorney. However... Something happened? They gave control of the investigation over to the police department. Mm. The police department. Edward no longer investigates. <laughs> uh, I sure hope he doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Any further investigation for this case will be directed by Chief of Police Grant. Grant? <laughs> oh, Gant. <laughs> I just so badly want his name to be Grant. <laughs> I can do nothing but wait for his results. I see. Why, I ask you? Why? 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 Oh, Han, I've done only what I believe is right. I have nothing to be ashamed of. <laughs> you can't have nice things. <laughs> listen, 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 listen. <laughs> listen. I'm not gonna say but listen, but still. <laughs> wow, I've never seen them in the side of sorts. Dang. You, you gonna be good, edgy boy? <laughs> uh, that's up for debate. That's up to for debate, sure. Um. Uh, oh right, I better check this now. As I was saying, I. Ah. What's this? A record of ID card usage. Edward, you went to the evidence room that day, didn't you? Just before the incident occurred, no less. Yes, that's true. Oh, look at this little trouble patty face! <laughs> Please, don't look at me like that. I was asked to go by Chief Grant. God damn it. <laughs> I was asked to go by Chief Grant, no less. It would be Grant so bad. <laughs> I'm calling it, he's the murderer. <laughs> I just don't like his face. <laughs> you don't like that beautiful pink, smile? Pink sunglasses, sunglasses looking ass. I don't know, he I'm seems sorry, stressful. Emma, but <laughs> I don't, I don't trust him. <laughs> his fucking police? beard looks like a. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna rip this man? And... <laughs> his, his beard looks like a seashell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're right. <laughs> like, how can you trust somebody like that? <laughs> he seems pretty shellfish to me. Get out. <laughs> Leave. <laughs> this is my stream. <laughs> <laughs> We're hijacking it. No! Garrett, yeah, when you get a chance, check your DMs. <laughs> okay. He wanted evidence for a case that wrapped up half a year ago. He told me he wanted to keep it here in the prosecutor's office. But it was solved, right? It would, ha it would have to be if the evidence was already filed. The chief is never one to explain himself. Sorry. Hello? In any case, on the day of the stabbings, I brought this back here. Can I ask what kind of case it was? I can't say. <laughs> Jessica says Gant is the personification of Floridian retirement homes. <laughs> It really has nothing to do with the current case. Oh, I had to stumble for a sec, thought I misread. <laughs> now I'm curious about this other case. Better make a note about it. Let me guess, does it start with an S? Hmm. Mm. It looks like it on the tag. Oh my fucking god. <clears throat> oh my god. Stubborn as always. I told you this has nothing to do with this current case. But I mean, you know. 
I just like when he yells at me. Can I look at it? Oh, that sure is a screwdriver. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's an A. Oh, uh, whoops. Attack says AI 16. <gasps> it's an AI! Oh god! <laughs> I was just thinking about that. <laughs> Ichi. <laughs> What's that got to do with anything? So I'm trying. I'm trying really hard to find a very specific meme right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Nothing apparently. <laughs> At least that's what Edward said. Hmm, that makes it seem all the more suspicious. I know, right? Who knows? This might turn out to be the clue that breaks the case. Hmm. Mm. Mm. Wouldn't that be nice? Hmm. <laughs> 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 I don't remember if it is <laughs> We're getting into the parts of the case that I really am having trouble remembering. Yeah, same. I already did that one. Uh, you know anything about the piece missing? Oh. <laughs> right, please. I'm the prosecutor on this case. <laughs> you don't expect me to sit here and discuss the case with you over a cup of tea? Maybe. Oh, he's yearning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he is. <laughs> I'll pass on the tea, just tell me about the case. Phoenix, you asshole. <laughs> Mr. Wright, Mr. Edgeworth just told you no in a very polite manner. <laughs> Whose side are you on, anyway? <laughs> His. Maybe I just show him my best evidence I can get some reaction out of him. Hmm. Uh... <laughs> Uh... Nope. <laughs> right, please. <laughs> Show him a ring. <laughs> I wish I had I one. Mean... Aha! Badge! Oh, no. <laughs> right, no. please. <laughs> Sorry. I, it's, it's a reflex when I can't think of anything. I show the badge. Oh my god. Let's we'll check the guide real quick, see if we... <laughs> you just test each and every piece of evidence. That's it's usually what I do action. when I don't when I play these games for the first time. I just test everything. Uh, have we presented the? Uh, the switchblade knife. Oh no, not yet. I was gonna do that eventually. <laughs> Aha. I know you. You probably got hold of some information already, right? It all has to do with that case you were on, the SL9 incident. And some dark suspicion you were wrapped up in. You are the man who revived the worst memory of my life, as I recall. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I figured I'd be telling you about this sooner or later. A bad memory. Let's talk about the murder in the elevator. Of course. What else would I be talking about, Phoenix? Yeah, like... <laughs> okay, Edgeworth, why don't you tell me about it? Tell me the truth. There's a few things that are worse than watching your father die before your very eyes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know. Oh, that was it? Uh, oh, we have to go in here now, I guess. Oh. <laughs> the SL9 incident was a heinous serial killing case. <coughs> the head of investigation was the, the head of investigation was the deputy chief of police at the time. Damon Grant. Grant. Grant, God fucking <laughs> damn, God damn it. Every time. That wacky old coot was involved in the case two years ago too, then. Wacky old coot. He was the best we had. And it was my first time working with him. I was nervous. <laughs> wow, oh, you I get am. nervous too, Mr. Edward. You feel emotions? <laughs> I, 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 am a, I am a human being. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm standing right here. I am bleeding. And <laughs> yeah, the emotion I'm feeling right now is frustration and annoyance. <laughs> right now I'm feeling shutting down. <laughs> oh no, he is a robot. I knew it. <laughs> what I want to know is why, why was a deputy chief of police on the investigation? Hmm. Truth, are you slightly more? Extreme methods than normal. We were dealing with a vicious murderer. If I let him go, blood would be on my hands. I mean, not necessarily. Blood is on your hands. 
already. We won our guilty verdicts, and the killer was executed. Wait, you didn't... Of course not. I didn't touch the evidence. I didn't say you did. <laughs> yes, I will do anything in my power to win a trial. However, I do have a code, and I follow it faithfully. <laughs> the robot theory is becoming true. Oh shit, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> by, by the way, Emma, shutting down. No, no! Booting <laughs> <laughs> up. The chief prosecutor wanted to know something. Rebooting. <laughs> Rebooting. Windows update available. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, he runs on Windows? <laughs> My sister? What? You still working on that scientific evidence? I like pause. I thought there was going to be like an epilepsis or something <laughs> while the thing was going and then it didn't. Scientific investigation. Okay. Huh? Y yes, of course. Why, well, just today Mr. Wright and I were using this. <laughs> Luminal testing fluid. Hmm. Spritzes it around his room on X. Just in her face. In <laughs> 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 Get the fuck out of my office. <laughs> I'm sorry, it wasn't a mess. <laughs> well, you might have use for this. <gasps> yes. <laughs> Aluminum powder for taking fingerprints. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, 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 nice. So Alright, let's trade. <laughs> let's trade. Be treated <laughs> for better adhesion. F for me? Are you sure? We are the enemy, you know. I'm not so sure about that. Oh, I have no sense <laughs> in his investigation. Do as you will. Oh, Edward, I'm really... Not you. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Uh, you <laughs> have your feelings yet, right? No. <laughs> no need to thank me. Here, take your pattern in those fingerprint, fingerprint files for everyone involved. I, uh, th thanks. How about giving these to Detective Gumshoe as well? Absolutely not. <laughs> he would lose them immediately. <laughs> I don't trust He'd anything. Drop it over the floor. <laughs> he would. Well, let's get going. One last investigation. Ta-da! He'd like drop it, like you know, like <laughs> you know, the boy got his free taco bag. In the arms of an angel. What you say? Fly away. <laughs> <laughs> right. I do seem to remember seeing a suspicious handprint somewhere. Huh. Uh -huh. I wonder, Phoenix. I wonder where any handprints in this case have been. On my ass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there. I have to go down to see the picture. <laughs> okay, yes. I just hate how the words are formatted so weirdly on these. Like, the longer the title, the squished more it squished it is, and I'm like, I, it's just, I can't read it. <laughs> In the evidence room again. Our investigation turned up a suspicious handprint. Hmm. Hmm. Here, in this blood- why did I say that so weirdly? <laughs> Here, in this blood on the detective evidence locker- Okay. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> Close it up. <laughs> Let's use the secret weapon we just borrowed. <laughs> and it's oh, all going I... on the lower screen where no one can fucking read this. <laughs> right, let's get started. First, choose a finger. It's just ketchup from the Splatfest. <laughs> <laughs> a finger? Each finger leaves behind a slightly different imprint. So let's choose the finger that will have the left behind the clearest print. Mm hmm. I really can't tell the difference at a glance. Quit procrastinating and choose a finger! Oh, yeah, okay! Uh, like the uh, um, uh, uh, that um. one. <laughs> oh no. Okay, now it's time to check for prints. Aha. Uh -huh. Let me show you how it's done. Emma's starting to get that sparkle in her eyes. 
First, we sprinkle the aluminum powder around. At least in, on my laptop, I actually have a setup that switches between the bottom screens and the top screens so you can see this better, but on this one, I don't. <laughs> it flashes if I click off, so I'm like, sorry. Mm, right, right. <laughs> huh? How do you do that? Just touch the screen, see? Achoo! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like that did the trick. The aluminum powder adheres completely to the print. Oh. Once the powder is well spread, just blow away the excess. Oh no, how am I going to do that? Uh oh. <laughs> um, uh, how do I do that? You just blow with your breath. Oh god, I forgot! <laughs> uh, 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 I did guess... we need a loophole? Um, uh, um... Can look, uh, quickly, look up how to do the microphone on this <laughs> room. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Imagine Hold your on, okay. candles. Wow, yeah, that looks yeah. like fun. Yeah, it might take some getting used to, though. <laughs> wait, wait, let's see if you can, like, BS it really quick first. And if not, <laughs> the, you can each you on speed dial. <laughs> I forgot about it, this. It might just work if you already mm. have a microphone plugged in. So, let's try. Uh, hey, hey, baby. <laughs> Just like scream into it. <laughs> That'd be what I do. <gasps> bam! Good bam! Morning. What's poppin', Bam? <laughs> we're trying. We we just have to blow on the screen. Hold on, I'll do. Hey, <laughs> on our real DS. <laughs> on our real DS. <laughs> blow away just the extra. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All the basics of fingerprinting, Mister Right. I guess I better give it a try. Okay. Okay, check, 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 check. Up, 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 up. Ah! Okay, no. <laughs> um, um. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna look. <laughs> this, um, this <laughs> microphone settings. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh, God. oh God. God. Uh. <laughs> ah! A little more powder. I think so. But I I switched it so it's reading my microphone on the like the actual microphone I'm blowing. But I can can I just blow like? <gasps> well, breathing in worked actually. <laughs> oh my god! You did it! You found one. That is not a fingerprint. <laughs> this is yeah, a dot. Just... This is just. <laughs> Inhale the powder. <laughs> but this looks nothing like a fingerprint. <laughs> hmm, now that you mention it, I guess it doesn't. Hmm. What does it mean? It think wait, it think it means <laughs> we're out of luck. I think it's because it's a glove. <laughs> out of luck. Yeah. Out of touch! <laughs> it's not Thursday, fuck. <laughs> The person who left this handprint must have worn gloves. I made a tweet about that. It's always out of touch Thursday. <laughs> out of time? <laughs> Don't tell me we're waiting, wasting our time here. We are out of time! And I'm out of my head when you're not around! <laughs> <laughs> hey, calm down. That's just the way it goes sometimes with scientific investigations. Are we ignoring the fact that there's an obvious handprint or fingerprint right next to it? <laughs> oh my god. It does seem a shame. Hmm. While we're at it, why don't we look for other prints? Other prints? Looking at the locker door again closely. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like there are fingerprints outside the bloody handprint as well. <laughs> I can't find any clues. All we have is this blood stain. <laughs> Let's see if we can find a clear print. Like... Hmm, fingerprints uh, outside the blood. I don't know, I can't see it. Do you guys see it? I don't see anything. Oh I don't, I don't, I don't know. Kidding. I think it's over here? Oh over God. here? Oh over here? God. I'm gonna shank oh. you. <laughs> nah, it's not. <laughs> Blue's... Oh <laughs> Blue's clue shit. <laughs> Ta -ta 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 
Did I just drag it? No, I have to tap. I can hear uh, it. Uh, really? A quick jump clear? It's dazzling! <laughs> noise I have to make for it to pick up. <laughs> Hold on, let me see if I can remember my forensics class. That's, uh... <laughs> D dazzling? Scream oh. away the pain. <laughs> anyway, this print looks took a lot of effort to find. You just put some powder on it. Just Let's match it up away. right away. <laughs> Wait, it can't be. That's my fingerprint. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh, oh God! At the camera. So we're His not done yet. Black. <laughs> this is quite a process. I've got it. Well, there's no <laughs> point in finding the fingerprint and not knowing who the owner is, right? <laughs> Nah, it's just, it's like, I found a fingerprint! No idea who it belongs to, though, but it's here! <laughs> Pretty neat. I guess she's right. Oh god, this thing. Look at the fingerprint <coughs> data we got from Mr. Edgeworth. We got that too? Point out the person you think left these prints. Huh? Mm -hmm. How am I supposed to know who it was? I could make a pretty good guess. Considering it's, you know, I don't know whose locker is this is. <laughs> Fingerprints are in different places, right? That means that the prints probably don't have anything to do with our case. Then why do we take them? So, whose fingerprints <laughs> do we most likely put? <laughs> so, whose <laughs> fingerprints will we most likely find on this evidence locker? I'm so confused. You! <laughs> I like you can see them though, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> that was that was easy. Whoa! Ooh! Ah! <laughs> How much of a headache it was to get through this, yeah. Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> so these prints belong to Detective Gumshoe. It Why is he so pissed? Why is he so pissed? <laughs> <laughs> Why is he so mad in this woman? <laughs> Why are you fucking angry? <laughs> Gumshoe's fucking pissed! Something <laughs> <laughs> wrong with the right? He gave me this so what look. <laughs> I guess that's probably because I was thinking so what. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we came up with nothing this time, but there's always next time. <laughs> sometimes you hit, sometimes you miss, but I guess you never miss, huh? We... <laughs> Gotta roll with the punches, Mr. Right. <sighs> Thanks for the sympathy. Wait, if I remember correctly, there was one other handprint in this room. Let's check it out! Uh, do I just have to, like, use the thing? No. Fucking, uh, can I, like, just It's on my ass! <laughs> can I look at it? This is where we got a luminol fluid reaction, right? Right! There was a handprint <coughs> there. Hmm. Okay, want to try using this? There go her eyes sparkling again. Leave it be. <laughs> okay, let's check for prints. No, let's just not check. Alright, <laughs> let's pack it up, let's go home. Let's go home. <laughs> <laughs> I give up on this case. But I have to warn you about something first. Uh-huh. What? The area with the blood was wiped away, right? We only ended up finding it using chemical means. Any prints in that area will have been wiped away too. Hmm. Oh, right. So that means no prints. Would you say the probability of your hypothesis is high? D don't ask me! Anyway, we must try to find prints that weren't wiped away. Hmm, hmm. Prints other than the ones left by the bloody hands. Wow, whoa! <laughs> uh, uh. Oh. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> You're all crazy, go stupid! Uh, I can think I can just talk oh, into the mic, funny. it's fine, honestly. Uh, <laughs> Cough. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
No. Oh. oh. All right, uh-huh. that was quick. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, fun little explanation for this part uh, is that they're trying to match up the different attributes that make up fingerprints different, and so to be considered a match, it needs at least 16 to be the same. Ah. <laughs> hey, these fingerprints, they... Whose are they? Whose? Is it someone I know? It's Officer Marshall! Huh? Uh, Officer Jake Marshall? Oh ho! Th- that's got to be a coincidence! Oh god, sorry, you only has a job! He's not involved in the crime! Lots of talking right. will do that. <laughs> When you talk for a long time, sometimes you just start yawning. I used to- I think it's to catch your breath, because... I used to yawn in the middle of, like, P.E. a lot. <laughs> just like... Just be, like, doing the, like, walk around the track, and then just start yawning. <laughs> Emma? This- this R decidedly different from detect- what? Excuse me? This R? This like are, are de- decidedly different from Detective Gumshoe's prints. <laughs> <laughs> the anime. anime gasp. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the luminal reaction. The blood and the fingerprints are in the same place. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> so we have Jake Marshall's fingerprints on a white blood stain. I'm surprised we don't have a bunch of hair around this as well. <laughs> But, why would Officer Marshall... Looks like our investigation is finally turning up some results! Erg. I'm stretching. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to stretch, you two. <laughs> Only cow <No>. stretch. Uh, <laughs> do, you, do, you want, do you want bones like me? Crunch, crunch, crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Old man Garrett. He also carved the shape of Texas next to the stain. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this is what you call decisive evidence. I. <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> well, Emma, are you okay? You like screamed that way. <laughs> to oh. be continued. It's only six fifty-three. Dang. I haven't even been streaming that long, have I? It's apparently an hour and a half, but like still, it doesn't feel like it's been that long. <laughs> Dude, let's go through more of the trial. Yeah. Alright. Make sure you are hydrated and stretch yourself. No. No, I swear I... to god. <laughs> Listen. I will instant Listen. transmission over to your place and make you do it. <laughs> do it, I dare you. I'll instant transmission behind your back. <laughs> and then I'll teleport behind you. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll, ch- I'll teleport behind you, behind you. And I'll teleport behind you, behind you, behind you. <laughs> Please, I can't, I can't. This is too fast. We're, we're it's moving like the, too fast, Garrett. It's a fucking I'm not ready to take this stage. <laughs> <laughs> it's how it's how we bond as friends. We have to teleport behind each other until we reach a loop around the world. Until <laughs> we hit the ocean. Until we hit the ocean. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, what do you think, Mr. Wright? I don't. <laughs> I try not to. <laughs> True question. I think that the prosecution is as confused as we are. After all. Oh, it's Lana. No, it's you! Oh. Oh, oh, the victim was murdered in two places at the same time. And, and a different suspect was arrested at the other crime scene. Lana! Good morning, Mr. Wright. Oh, wow. Still cold, huh? <laughs> I apologize for yesterday. I was... Indispo- in- What? What? Indisposed? Indisposed. I- okay, I had it, I guess. Yeah. I hope they didn't hold you too long for questioning. We just finished, actually. I'm used to all night as well. So, how'd it go? It says Mr. Red suspects. The police are clueless. Damn. Damn. I, th- <laughs> I figured as much. 
So I struck a plea ga- bargain. A plea bargain? What do you mean by that? We agreed that if I told them the truth about this simultaneous murder, they wouldn't see capital punishment. That is what I mean, Emma. Mm. <coughs> mm. But Lana, don't tell me you... Much to my regrets. I'm as much in the dark about this as they are. No one knows what the hell's happening. <laughs> oh boy. I don't know oh, what Jesus. the fuck just happened. <laughs> and I don't really care. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Get the fuck up out of here. <laughs> this guy. Hmm. We discovered traces left by a certain person in the police department's in evidence room. It belonged to Officer Jake Marshall. You found a officer. Oh, look. Seeing F's with the accent is hard. <laughs> you found Officer Marshall's traces. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm. <laughs> His traces, as in all that fucking hair on the floor. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Blood stained fingerprints, to be exact. And a Texas shaped bloodstain. <laughs> That's the trump card I have up my sleeve today. You do understand what this means, don't you? <clears throat> In order to defend my sister, you're going to accuse Mr. Marshall? We're gonna have to ask how ye. <laughs> <laughs> we have to play the cards we're dealt. Isn't that right, Miss Guy? Hey, you don't need to worry about playing cards until seven years from now, Dana. <laughs> oh no, oh no. <laughs> do what you have to do, Mr. Wright. She's even She's turning into more of an African accent now. <laughs> Speaks even like good at cards. <laughs> no, well, no, he. Well, yes, because of Trucy. But yeah, yeah, okay, yes, that's true. <clears throat> now to find my dead voice. Court is now in session for the trial, Miss Lana Sky. The defense is ready, Your Honor. The prosecution is. <laughs> Um, hmm? Um. I'm afraid you'll have to clarify. It takes 30 minutes by car to reach criminal affairs from the prosecutor's office. The victim, Bruce Skinman, was slain in both places at the same time. Just kind of oh, just skip past the... <laughs> yeah, he's just like, you know what, fuck it, I don't give a shit anymore. <laughs> but that's not physically possible, is it? What's more, I hear the victim from the evidence room just disappeared. <laughs> I had to walk. <laughs> <laughs> but Edgeworth has a car. <laughs> yes, and the body eventually reappeared in the trunk of Mr. Edgeworth's car. Although I don't think it's moved from the... Uh... From <laughs> the crime scene, though. So I guess Edgeworth would have to walk everywhere right now. <laughs> it's evidence now. Oh shit, you're right. <laughs> wow, this is one messed up trial. No, you got that one right! One of my duties as the prosecutor is to present impartial evidence. Today, I will present evidence relating to the murder at the police department. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> in doing so, I believe... Uh, in doing so, I believe a way in which we should proceed will reveal itself. Now that's what sets Mr. Edgeworth apart. He sounds so on top of things. Mm -hmm. Even though he doesn't know what's going on himself. <laughs> That's me giving a presentation <laughs> in school. That's me writing essays in school. <laughs> Just use enough therefores and you sound like you got it. Right! And however... <laughs> and that's supposed to be an admirable trait. <laughs> Very well, let the trial resume. On the day of the crime, what exactly transpired at the police department? <laughs> Mr. Edward, you may call your first witness of the day to the stand. For its first witness, the prosecution calls. Me! <laughs> the suspect of the murder that occurred at the police department. Oh, lord. In oh, get ready. <laughs> looks more like a boy. I'm so sorry for, for you, folks. <laughs> the suspect? You mean the so-called murderer? Have, 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 have. Ooh, oh, boy. Me. Things are getting wild from the get-go. Oh boy. <clears throat> He's not wasting any time. There he is. Oh, okay. Here goes nothing. 
Will the witness please state his name and occupation? Uh, before you do this, I have to lower your volume really fast. Yeah, go <laughs> ahead. <laughs> I was also gonna move the mic further away from me. So, sorry for the flashing, but I have to do that, or else we will all have our ears blown out. <laughs> <laughs> Telling us you're a professional killer? Sir, it was me, sir. I'm the one who did it. <laughs> I'll never kill anyone again, so you've got to believe me, sir. <laughs> For case five ends. <laughs> oh, good heavens. Uh, actually, what? Well, uh... Case close. We're done here. <laughs> Please, Mr. Edgeworth, sir, help me, sir. <laughs> Officer Meekins. Yes, sir. <laughs> Give us your report of the crime. Consider that an order. <laughs> Ichi, do you see chat? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to hear that in his voice. <laughs> Fine, what's that? <laughs> yes, sir, as you wish. After all, I'm part of the generation that must be told what to do, sir. <laughs> you can't fault him for a lack of enthusiasm. <laughs> Murder TikTok. Oh. <laughs> Crime <Really>? report, sir. <laughs> Although it's not my normal duty, I was assigned to go to the evidence room that day. He spotted a suspicious man on the screen. <coughs> Rushed into the room. <laughs> I was only doing what I was trained to do, sir. I was suddenly attacked. I fought for my life. Then I, I did it. <laughs> After that, I passed out until another officer smacked me away. Rest okay, in peace. Like, if he did it in self-defense. I know. Yeah. Hmm. So the victim, Detective Goodman, attacked you? Do it to others before they do it to you! <laughs> That's the Meekins family motto, sir! I see. Then you fainted and a colleague helped you regain consciousness. Yes, sir! You knocked me upside the head, sir! <laughs> Very well. I love him so much. The defense may begin its cross-examination. What I need here is more info to work with. Oh boy! Alright! Trial time, oh. baby! <laughs> you do not need to read these again. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> That's our normal thing, is when we're doing the actual like cross-examination, you don't I have know, to read these. My brain just like, <laughs> yeah. going out, and then I was like, I have to do it. I have to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Mike Meekins is my favorite of my least favorite characters. <laughs> uh, why were you guarding? Mr. Meekins, you work in the General Affairs Department, do you not? Yes, sir! <laughs> I'm in charge of hiring new recruits, sir! Wait, Wait. this dude <laughs> is in charge of hiring other dudes? Oh, no. Oh, honey. Oh, he had Yikes! Um, <laughs> There's a scary thought! <laughs> Evidence transfer was taking place on the day of the crime. <sighs> which meant many officers were given special tasks not ordinarily performed. Hmm. I was in charge of guarding the blue badgers, sir! <laughs> oh, <laughs> honey. Oh, no. <laughs> Lord in heaven! <laughs> You know what? He's got a lot of support. I respect it. <laughs> the blue badger? Yes, sir! The lovely police mascot created by the head detective, sir! <laughs> there he is. Oh, no. We're in the blue badger void. No! <laughs> it's the Shadow Realm ruled by a blue badger. 
Is that holding a screwdriver? What is that? I don't... One, one's like a baton, like a police baton, the other's just like a flag. Yeah. Why is it red? Don't ask me, dude. <laughs> Gumshoe <laughs> painted it, man, I don't know. I'm a soon sure it wasn't broken during the transferal process. It's crying. <laughs> like me. <laughs> that was my sole mission for the day, sir. <laughs> the blue badger void. <laughs> We're free. I see. Sounds like a very, uh, important mission. After the award ceremony finished that day, there were so many people running around that he relocated the blue badger to the evidence room. Oh, so that's why you went to the evidence room. <clears throat> Tell us, what did you see when you got there? <laughs> Look at his cold, dead eyes. <laughs> the blue badger's the murderer. He's a killer. <laughs> <laughs> it was him all along! I spy a seditious man. I'm gonna press most of these, probably. In order to enter the evidence room, you need an ID card, am I correct? Precisely, sir! I have one right here around my neck! Ah. So then, your ID number should be listed in here, right? Aha. The... There it is! I found it! This is the one right there! B could you please read us the number? Yes, sir! It's 98... Wait! 4989596! That's my number, sir! He just punched his own injured hand. <laughs> I know, he does that a lot. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, I don't think he's okay. <laughs> you some ice? I see. Huh? But the number... Four nine eight nine five nine six. Well, sure is being used twice. Please explain, witness. Beg. <laughs> Grovel. <laughs> Grovel. <laughs> the first time was when I relocated Blue Badger to the evidence room. And the second time is when I went to go get him after everything settled down. I see. So it was during that. So it was with. So it was during that second time when. Yes, sir. That was when I spotted the man on the security screen. <laughs> da da da. Well, who's the sevens? <laughs> I think I know. I think I know too, but I, I thought off the top of my head. So you were attacked. Can you please tell us exactly what happened to you? It was a knife, sir. A knife. Man, I have eight viewers right now? Hello to all the viewers. It's poppin'. It's poppin', Hello. dude! It's Friday game night, and we're boppin' right now. <laughs> yeah, vibin'. Detect uh, heh. Detective Goodman pulled a knife on you? What happened then? Well, with me charging it on him like that, he looked as surprised as I was. You aren't exactly the kind of person someone would want to run into. <laughs> Aw, Phoenix! Oh, come on, Phoenix, what the hell? <laughs> he stabbed me, I'm dead. <laughs> That's what I reacted, sir! I swung my arms like an octopus, struggling to detain him! <laughs> I can see it now. I got this flash on my head! He's just like windmilling his arms. <laughs> Maybe if you just kept your cool, your hand wouldn't be. When I saw the blood trickling down my arm, I panicked! I grabbed the man by his collar! Oh. I fought for my life! You're an expert in cephalopod warfare! <laughs> what exactly did you mean when you say you did it? I know I don't look the time, but I'm really into Kung Fu films, sir! <laughs> The man left his guard down for just an instant, so I snatched his knife from him. I watched Trial of the Dragon! <laughs> <laughs> you took his knife? I spun him around and performed the disarm in a maneuver. I somehow am having trouble imagining him do that. <laughs> He's a twink. <laughs> I be sure to close my eyes like a man. What's Bruh. a love? Oh, no. <laughs> Me kids <laughs> up. What? What's a level under Twink? <laughs> is that what um, Mikit says? <laughs> Hit him with the skadoosh. Wink. 
I think it's just a twig at that point. A twig. Yeah, he's just a twig. He doesn't have a classification. It's just a twig. He's his own classification, just called Meekins. Meekins. <laughs> you don't want to be a Meekins. Uh, I see. Must have been desperate. The next thing I know, his white coat was stretched to the sea of my blood, and then... You, uh, how much did you bleed? Then the next thing I did, like, you don't even bleed that much from your I face. know. <laughs> it's the twig nature. <laughs> this is just one poke and it all comes coming Unless you're out. playing in, like, a fighting game that spews blood every time you hit someone, and then suddenly it's like, so how much blood do these people have? <laughs> so, so, yeah. Because it's in Tekken. Oh, God. New DLC character for the next Tekken game, Meekins. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's always cool look at characters, and then there's Meekins. <laughs> it's like, wait, 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 who's this guy? <laughs> did you say this line? I don't remember. <laughs> I, I think I did. I don't. Next thing you knew, yes, Meekins for Smash. I'm in the face, sir. I'm just imagining Meekins in the next Smash Direct. Okay. Like, <laughs> you, it, all it would take is a single hand to go around his throat. Like, <laughs> it was! Yeah, exactly. Like, you need like two fingers. <laughs> I could just hold him with like one finger and a thumb at that point. Like, <laughs> you just kind of like ragdoll him around. <laughs> After you passed out, and then another guy smacked you awake. So what time did you regain consciousness? No offense, sir, but how am I supposed to know that I was unconscious? I said when you woke up. <laughs> oh, right. According to the report that they uh, I can read. Like Itachi old <laughs> <Hill> Sasuke. <laughs> I was I was thinking that and it didn't want to say it, so thank you. <laughs> I, I want I want to redraw that meme. <laughs> oh please do! Wait, is it please? like Nell holding up? Nell holding up Meekins. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Okay, according to the report from the officer that woke up that woke up the witness, it was about five thirty. <laughs> What did it sound like? I mean, uh... <laughs> I don't think you want me to that I know. That's nice. Uh, I mean, it's nice that you recovered, that is. When I came around, though, I made sure to finish my mission, sir! Your mission? Yes, sir! The Blue Badger, sir! Ah. Uh. <laughs> so... Did you to the entrance before things got out of hand? <laughs> so, so, so. He well, contaminated the scene of a crime. Technically, <laughs> well, we can all rest easy now. The blue badger is the murderer. He's more of an accomplice. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Look at those solar size. <laughs> I, uh, I believe we now have a fairly accurate picture of what happened. Uh, oh God! <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> yes, Your Honor. Only one thing remains unclear. <laughs> Your Honor, have you, have you been drinking? <laughs> no. <laughs> Was the man that this officer murdered really the victim? Hmm. It's got a point. Um. Yes, Officer Meekins? With regard to that, sir. Take a look at this. Oh no! Uh, yeah, I was rem I was waiting for the video. <laughs> she get delivered it to me this just this morning, sir. What is with you people not reporting evidence? <laughs> right? <laughs> the, the chief delivered it. What is that? A videotape? It's a VCR tape. It's a VCR, my dude. <laughs> Yes, sir, that's absolutely right, sir. A video tape, sir. VHS, well, the first book. The VHS. Mood. <laughs> that is a goddamn mood. Wait for the those five. <laughs> it's actually pretty good. I haven't watched I it yet. I watched it. Shh. I mean, I meant to watch it. I know it's on Netflix. Forgot. Just give me a little bit. It's exactly the same, except for the fact that it's CGI. Yeah, I figured. But, like, hmm. it's, but it doesn't look it's amazing. It's actually very 
very good. It, it has very nice graphics, and I still uh, cried. Of I course, it's still the first movie. <laughs> <laughs> it contains two footage from the security camera at the evidence room. Ah. Why the fuck did anyone tell me about this? <laughs> what? But I specifically asked if there was such a tape. <laughs> And was told it had been mistakenly erased. Oh, that's quite a mistake. Anton's <laughs> just like, sorry, worthy. Sorry, worthy. <laughs> Wink. <laughs> I just do what I told you. So it's the only thing I'm really good at. I'm sorry, worthy. Aww. I totally slipped my mind. Ha ha ha. Fuck you. Please, <laughs> <laughs> we did a fucky wucky. <laughs> did a fucky wucky. <laughs> 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 Looks like the communication with the police department is as good as ever. Well then, let's have a look! Show us the video of you murdering the victim! You shit worthy, my boy! Oh, Sorry. please don't give me that word, murder, sir! It scares me! <laughs> you, you really called yourself a murderer. <laughs> you really did, you came out! <laughs> Eat shit worthy, my boy! <laughs> <laughs> just like that loving video of a real murder. Just what are we getting ourselves into? Oh, a real crazy. murder? Oh, here we go. Oh, <laughs> oh shit, it's no. an actual video. Yeah, it's an actual video. Wait till the 3D kicks in. <laughs> oh my god, look at the CGI. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> you know what, I take it back. <laughs> <gasps> He's crying. He's <laughs> crying. <laughs> oh shit, oh lord. Oh lord, he coming. What? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> and then Meekins uh, no. died. <laughs> we were talking to his ghost right now. <laughs> oh rip. Uh. Where'd he go? <laughs> hmm. Where did he go? <laughs> <laughs> it's like Five Nights at Freddy's up in here. <laughs> like, goodness, like, army crawling all along the floor. <laughs> this is actually Phoenix's Silent Hill. <laughs> <laughs> well, I believe we're all thinking the same thing. What the How can we was deal with these unsettling feelings stirred within us? No, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm so glad he thought that. <laughs> what the hell was that wriggly piece of plywood? Why am I not surprised? This isn't going smoothly. <laughs> Do any of Phoenix's cases go smoothly? Uh, no. <laughs> Never. When has it ever gone smoothly? Sonic! <laughs> yes, well, anyway. This tape seems to prove that some of the wit- that pit pit This tape seems to Take prove that, <laughs> that the witness did indeed encounter uh, someone in the evidence room. And some sort of, uh, activity did take place. <laughs> Your Honor, instead of relying on clearly incomplete footage, the witness's testimony will su suffice. 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 <laughs> suffice. <laughs> suffice. 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 <laughs> suffice. suffice. Is it like, can you do it either other way, or is it just suffice? I've only ever heard suffice. <laughs> I, I think yeah. it's suffice. It is suffice. You know what? <laughs> Would you just go- oh my god. All I right, was well, making fun of you for saying that. suffice. <laughs> That's why I repeated I it. it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, I get bullied for how I pronounce words too. <laughs> None of us are safe if we're being honest. Is that alright with you, Officer Mugen? No, you're starting to sound kind of far away, by the way. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Let me let me let me bring this back over. How do I sound? Better. Good. Nice. Yes, sir. As you wish, sure. Sure. <laughs> I, don't <know. laughs> I don't know what. It's just it's it just incomprehensible noises at this point. That's kind of what Meekins is devolving. It's his whole into. vibe. <laughs> his face can't be clearly seen in the video. But there's no question that the other person was Detective Goodman, sir! Babe. I mean, he opened the locker, which required Detective Goodman's fingerprint to, so... 
<laughs> the locker he opened was unquestionably Detective Goodman's locker, sir! So it must be him! No one else could have unlocked it! <laughs> My eyesight sucks. He did close his uh, eyes when he went swinging. I'm about to start swinging! <laughs> What's this about a fingerprint? Each detective has been given a locker, equipped with a fingerprint activated lock. And now Nell's super loud. <laughs> ah, she. I don't know. Ah. These locks ensure that each locker can only be a lock. Uh, yeah. These locks ensure that each. Oh my god. <laughs> you got this. Ah. These locks. You know, I just can't read at this point. I might as well just jump out the window. Anyway. <laughs> that girl just leaves. <laughs> These locks ensure that each locker can only be opened by the detective it belongs to. There you go. Intriguing. That would mean the victim at the crime scene would have to have been Detective Goodman. Very well. The defense may begin its cross-examination. I don't know where this cross-examination will lead. But everything begins with contradictions. That's where I have to start. <laughs> the blue badger theme stuck in my head now. <laughs> Can't be seen in the video. There's no question that the other person is Detective Goodman. I mean, he opened the locker. Duh. I I feel like. Like, okay, when he opened the locker, there was that glove that fell off, right? <laughs> Thing is, I know exactly how he opened the locker, but... You know. I don't remember how he opened it. <laughs> I do remember this part. Because I remember the video very well, actually. This section of the trial I remember a lot. I fucking hated it. <laughs> About these lockers, is there no other way to open them? No, sir! I tried myself all kinds of methods in the past! <laughs> They only respond to registered fingerprints, sir! Oh god, we gotta oh. be examining that video 50 times! You're so fucking right. <laughs> wonder what kind of methods he's tried. He tried, like, bobby pins, credit <laughs> cards... He threw things at it, fucking tried to plunge it open with a plunger he stole... Used... Open sesame at it. Used Marshall's lasso on it. <laughs> oh my god. If the man opened the locker's lock, which only responds to its registered fingerprints, then he must be the person the locker was assigned to. <laughs> exactly my point, sir! I this too! <laughs> locker opens that question- How do you know that information? I've heard rumors, sir! From people in the know, sir! People in the know? The workers in the department cafeteria, sir! They keep me informed! <laughs> they also listen to my romantic travels, sir! Oh, uh -oh. So. <laughs> oh, oh, no! Oh, no. Oh, Jesus Christ, no. <laughs> Please, I like you. Don't make me stop. <laughs> I don't remember doing that. Oh, no. my God. <laughs> For the record, the open locker did indeed belong to Detective Goodman. I verified this information through a more <laughs> reliable source. Through me constating Sim. Absolutely not. <laughs> the voice actor's all Ichi. <laughs> <No>! <laughs> He walks into the studio and there's like 10 things of water bottles. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like, like you know those like giant in like gallon drops. things you get? Ugh. In like the office, in like offices. Yeah, like the, for the water coolers. Yeah, water whatever. coolers. It, but like, the, you just have your mouth under the tap. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> mm. So the victim opened the locker with his own fingerprint. But I sure hope do? so. So it must be <laughs> I don't know why he's still reading oh, it! Oh, Jesus. <laughs> no one else could have unlocked it. Uh, okay. Also, fun fact, did you know the Y button thing here? Have I talked about that before? 
That's like when you yell objection. Yeah, you can actually yell objection and hold it. If you hold down the Y button, speak that into the microphone, you'd be like, hold it! And it, like, does it. It, like, presents it for you. It's another way to push oh. the button. You I like should, the, You should uh, maybe do that. <laughs> maybe I will try it, since I have the microphone thing actually turned on now. Can I look at this? <laughs> oh my god. No, not Kira! No, 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 I hate how it blocks it right there. It's so annoying. Look at he go. Oh, Lord, he's coming. What? With the most pathetic smack. I know! I love the fucking just how they fight and then it's immediately over when it pans back over. Uh, okay. I we're supposed to present something, obviously. Mm -hmm. I okay, will look at the leg eye. This can't be seen clearly, yes. Um. Uh, he opened the locker which required the fingerprint. Locker open is unquestionably the, the yes. fifth statement. This one? Like the it must be him? I think. Yeah. Uh, uh, ah, excuse me. <laughs> Bite the dust. <laughs> However. <laughs> However, get your fucking stands out of here. This is a trial. <laughs> the most important detail is not shown in this video. The man's face! Please do. After all, you are the one being examined. I don't understand why the man's face is so important in the case, sir. Um... I mean, it was his hand that opened the fingerprint lock. It has to be Goodman, though. It was his hand that tried to thrust his knife into my body, sir. Oh, God. I was not able to testify to this, sir. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Are you okay over there? <laughs> I'm about to break sound barrier. <laughs> you are. <laughs> I can feel my my own fucking <laughs> desktop is about to crack in half at this point. <laughs> if not my brain. <laughs> yes, you have a point. The footage do footage doesn't lie. That is. Unless the defense can find a problem with Oh, there's a problem. Uh, there's several problems with this video. You're right, let's check the court record again. Here we go, I got to do deal with this stupid fucking shit. No problem! <laughs> On the night. <laughs> Everything will be daijobu. <laughs> <laughs> Regarding the video contained on this tape, there's one thing in particular that seems rather strange. One? One thing, Phoenix. One? Just the blue badger. single? The blue badger! <laughs> this contradiction leads to the possibility that the man may not be Detective Goodman. What? This video contains such a contradiction? Interesting. Your Honor, I have a proposal. <laughs> yes, Mr. Edgeworth? I propose we have a def uh, we have the defense. <laughs> not a defense. Point out to us the alleged contradiction in this video. <laughs> Chuckling at chat. <laughs> First, Gant is a stand user. Just look at his outfit. <laughs> and then, it's a shadow self detective bad man. <laughs> <laughs> he would want me to point it out. Of course he would. Damn you, Edgeworth. Very well. Proposal accepted. Let us further inspect this piece of evidence. I don't know if you're allowed to do that in court. I will now play the security tape. Mr. Wright, please show us this contradiction you speak of. I like to imagine when they brought out the tape, they had to wheel out the like TV on the stand. Yeah, like the one oh, yeah, that yeah, goes yeah, in yeah, school. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like squeaky wheels and everything. Like Bill Nye. Yeah. <laughs> like gym class or something. Whoops, I left the Bill Nye tape in. <laughs> Bill, 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 Bill. This is the first time I've ever had to do this. You can do it, Mr. Wright. I believe in myself. It's set up so you can fast forward, rewind, or pause the video. Thank God. Thank oh, God. thank God. Yeah. 
good luck and be sure to point out the right thing. Please don't pay it too many times. I, I can't stand watching this video. We're gonna play it over and over again so you can see you getting beat the fuck up over and over. <laughs> How did this guy ever become a police officer? Now then, Mr. Wright, please enlighten us. Where is the contradiction that indicates the man may not be Detective Good? Oh god, here we go. Uh, mm. I think that's good enough right there. Like it's, this it, it's blocking his yeah, it's blocking, blocking his face and the thing's time. coming out, so I'm gonna say this. Okay. Did you, you I, have to move it? I don't know. Uh this oh uh, <laughs> no. Hold, hold on, on a second, yeah. I need to use my eye drops. <laughs> I don't get it. Uh, would you mind if I borrowed your eye medicine? <laughs> don't look at me with those bleary eyes. Don't look at me with those big ol' eyes. <laughs> so, we need I to didn't... present. We need to select the glow. Yeah, I figured. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Before your eyes get too teary, perhaps you should think this through again. Sorry. Now what do I do? I'll, I'll play the video again. Just go back and... Uh, it didn't take a point off, thank God. Just remember one thing, right? Every time you point your finger, someone gets hurt. You mean like this? Do it right now. <laughs> ah, Special <laughs> beam cannon. No, I got it. No. <laughs> Suddenly he's Frieza. <laughs> <laughs> just the beam comes out of Edgeworth's finger and just shoots me in the heart. <laughs> Shoot stupid G. <laughs> there. <laughs> but he's the one pointing. <laughs> <laughs> I will not play the security tape. Mr. Wright, show us the contradiction. Okay. <laughs> you got this. I get it. Uh huh. Yep. That, that, okay. Here we go again. Yeah, okay. I see the thing on the screen. I totally forgot that was there. This? Or is it this? Uh, uh, I think it's the yes, that. glove? I think so. Yeah. I didn't realize you had the music that's like, playing. <laughs> it's gonna get stuck in your head after stream. Stuck in my head right now. The thing that's strange about this video has got to be this! Special beam cannon! <laughs> oh god! He's dead. Hmm, dead yes, that's dead. strange. Will you guys what stop? Shoes he got on. <laughs> shoes he got on. I don't get that meme. I just came out of nowhere. <laughs> I, I'm trying to do a freeze of voice, but I can't. <laughs> but just, just fucking Bam's rendition of that meme. <laughs> Bam's rendition is good. That's why she can't pray to Jesus. <laughs> she ain't got no knees. Oh, <laughs> Something certainly seems unnatural about that. What could it mean? Oh, I, I... <laughs> Sorry to interrupt, Mr. Wright. I have ten viewers! Ooh! But you seem to have forgotten uh, the point of this exercise. No, where have you gone? You, look, you sound like you're facing away from the mic. I, 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 mo I moved around a lot. Oh, okay. So <laughs> it's like, <laughs> my mic hello? shuffled. Double digits! Park! <laughs> the point? What you're looking for is one thing, and one thing only. Something that indicates the man might not. Uh, something that indicates the man may not be Detective Goodman. I mean, oh yeah. <laughs> Ew! I almost walked right into the defense's trap. Now my trap card. Damn it! Please <laughs> <laughs> under arrest, sir. Rats! <laughs> I need to slow down and tackle these things one piece at a time. Now what do I? Oh, I. Mm. I guess I have to look at the flag. In front of his face. Every time you point your finger. <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> Stop pointing at me! I hate this fucking video. <laughs> it takes forever to get here! I gotta put Phoenix in defense mode. I don't think we choose the flag. Do we not? I mean, he comes yeah, in. To... So. And he. Oh! Uh... Before good. Before Goodman walks over. Oh? Uh. We have to present that the light's on already. Oh. Wait. Can we just 
Look at the light. Then. Uh, no, 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 not that light. The light of the locker. Oh, oh, oh! You're right. I forgot about the fucking light on the locker. Cause that shows it's on already. Yeah. Oh. I feel so dumb. I know. I feel dumb too. Cause I remember when I first did this on my own time, I actually did get this wrong until that too. Uh, this is the same exact thing I got caught up on again. <laughs> Officer Meekins. As I understand it, the locker apparatus looks works like this. Oh god, the music's back again. <laughs> oh Jesus. No, the other weekends. <laughs> when you grab the handle, a sensor reads your fingerprint. If the print matches the the registered data, the light turns on and the lock is released. According to my very limited real experience, that's the way I understand it, sir. <laughs> If so, then something is seriously wrong with this picture! I forgot about it because it's in black and white, that's why. <laughs> it totally was not looking. Oh, when the victim reaches for the handle to open the locker. <laughs> Let's rewind to a little early. God damn it! <laughs> ah! Here we are. The reason I hate this video is because we do things this slow just so everyone understands. Two hours later. Here, notice the light? What's this? It's already lit! Fam! <laughs> <clears throat> Precisely my point, your honor. Please don't use that lingo. I'm begging. <laughs> the locker was already open before the victim grabbed the handle! Hashtag lit in the court! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> order, order! What's the meaning of this? It's very simple, your honor. The locker wasn't locked on the day of the crime. Ah. But these locker locks are controlled by an electronic system. That was the driest line ever. When a door is shut, a sensor is triggered. And the locker is automatically closed. <laughs> Oh, I know. It must have broken down. Of course, I'm not an expert in this. You fucking idiot. That's not <laughs> likely, Your Honor. <laughs> the sensor would detect and report any malfunction. You fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, well. Dumbass piece of shit. <laughs> Just goes to show, uh, novices should keep their mouths shut. So then, Mr. Wright, do you have an explanation? <laughs> Are you an expert in anything? <laughs> Me, Your Honor? Yes, why wasn't the locker locked? Uh, me, your honor? <laughs> uh, yes, well, you see, this isn't exactly my field. What do you think, Miss Scientific Investigator? Huh? Oh, um... Maybe something like, jam the electronic system? Something jam the sensor? Say... Oh, oh, oh. There's something else that seems out of place. Out of touch, you might say, in this video. Out of my mind? Yeah, I uh. thought so, too. <laughs> There's got to be another clue somewhere in this footage. Hmm. Very well, let's inspect the video once more. God fucking god. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Locker wasn't locked, Mr. Wright. Please point out the cause for this. Like the Apollo case with the Gavin ears. Oh, god. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Uh -huh. Boink. <laughs> Boink. I really have to pee. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> no. <laughs> Please watch closely. This is a continuation of the part I showed you earlier. I never knew. I didn't know this was a VHS of the never-ending story. <laughs> god. It is at this point. The never-ending case. Oh uh, Jesus Christ! Here we go again. We don't have the music this time. Uh, oh, thank shit. god. <laughs> Silence. Here we go again. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> Here we go again. What's <laughs> this? Oh, whoa. Something white fell out of the locker. Oh, whoa, we what's this? We pointed that out last time. <laughs> I swear to fucking I god. know. You have to do it in order, and it sucks, because my brain always jumps ahead like five things. <laughs> okay. What's, sir? It's 
been my experience that things fall out when doors are open. What? <laughs> How often do you open doors and things fall out at you, weekends? What the Car door? <laughs> we can't be sure that the item was was in the locker to begin with. What do you mean? The sensor triggers the lock when the door is shut. What if something was inserted, say, between the sensor and the door? In inserted? Ah, we are good. The horses don't think. Oh god. So how you guys been so far? <laughs> Staying I'm hydrated. Slowly losing my mind. I hear it's dying, but yeah. Stay hydrated. Probably... This white thing no. wasn't inside the locker. It was stuck between the door and the sensor. Oh, <clears throat> I understand it now, sir. Just like my tie. Home <laughs> slice. Do you know how many times I get stuck at the door when I get out of my patrol vehicle, sir? God damn. <laughs> Instead of the door closing, my tie chokes me. But, but the object would have to be extremely thin to fit in the door. Not only that, it would also have to block electronical, electrical currents. I would- it would need to be an insulator. Oh. <laughs> oh? Do I have the evidence for you? So, a glove. <laughs> yes, an insulator, but at the crime scene, there just might have been something that fits the description. But, but sir, by insulator you don't mean- I think I finally got this figured out. We just keep fucking interrupting me, kids. <laughs> Very well. Will the defense please present present the the, the the please present the relevant evidence? <laughs> hmm. What type of common material common for gloves could also insulate? <laughs> no idea, man. It was the blue badger. Oh. <laughs> it was this. Like that. I found this near the locker. A thin rubber glove. But we can't be sure that was in the victim's locker. It has a tag that says SL9 incident. <gasps> the video seems to depict the victim opening the locker. But that isn't the case. The lamps attest to, to, to this. On the day of the crime, even I could have opened that locker. Is this not so, Officer Meekins? <laughs> choking himself in the middle of the court. Oh no. <laughs> order! 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 So are we to believe that, that the victim whom this witness stabbed in the evidence room was not Detective Goodman? But Do not be misled, Your Honor. Has Meekins even seen Goodman's face? <laughs> That's a good question. Does he even know what Goodman's supposed to look like? <laughs> I think that answer is no. <laughs> What do you mean, Mr. Edgeworth? The defense has merely demonstrated the possibility, and nothing more. I think we have to jump to these loopholes, and we could just ask, Do you know this man? And show the picture of Goodman, and he'd be like, what? <laughs> I feel like that would just break down the whole testimony. I know! <laughs> the victim in this vo video was indeed Bruce Goodman. Was it? The prosecution will offer one more testimony to prove this. <laughs> what? Officer Meekins? Please testify about this. Oh boy. Sir, me, sir. I'm not sure what you're referring to, sir. Spruce oh, Batman. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why is Spruce the opposite of Bruce? <laughs> oh, you mean that, sir? Of course, sir. <laughs> Is this a joke? Very well, begin your testimony. Oh boy. Mystery Man 2! Mystery Man 2! Jumps! <laughs> Just the jump! <laughs> Sounds like you're losing your voice, Ichi. <laughs> I'm... I don't know if I am. I, I am fucking apologize wholeheartedly if you wake up tomorrow not able to speak. <laughs> like, Garrett. Garrett. <laughs> Garrett. 
You did this to me. <laughs> oh god, no! <laughs> An ID card record, I see. I have the ID card record right here, Your Honor. I want to know what the first one is. I logged it at 420. <laughs> it was probably Gantz. Me. It was me. <laughs> the ID used at 514 is that of the victim. The pitch somehow raises every time. <laughs> listen, listen. We're talking about Ichi's voice, I think. <laughs> It just grows. <laughs> it gets higher pitched and to the point where it's just... It doesn't have sound anymore. Well, just like... Cats watching the trial. <laughs> eating popcorn. <laughs> it would be. Just before the crime, hmm? Yes, without a doubt, this is the victim's ID. However, one thing does strike me as unusual. Several hundred cases should have been due for transfer. Why were there so few people using this room? Oh. This particular evidence room is only used for storing certain special cases. Eh. Special cases? Special cases. Can you not read the lips that are coming out of my mouth right now? <laughs> Extremely violent cases involving police staff. Just hearing that makes my hair stand on end. Me too, although it doesn't make much of a difference. That's true. <laughs> it's spiky ass, motherfucker. There was only a few cases up for transferal there, and most were cleared up by noon. Right, I see. Now, let us move on to the cross-examination. Alright, I'm taking a bathroom break real fast, I really have to go. I need to get more water. <laughs> yes, yeah. Yeah. yeah, break time, break time! Woo! Um, I'm just gonna leave it on the screen. I have a BRB screen, but it'll flash if I move it, so... Oh, uh, yeah. I'm running off! I'm going! I'm not turning off the mic, I'm coming back right... Anyway... <laughs> the murderer is Von Karma again. Oh fuck! <laughs> Come on, Pharma. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. Hello. Hello. I got a popsicle. Oh, nice. I dribbled water on the desk. I can't fucking live in this house without dribbling stuff everywhere. I'm a fucking mess. <laughs> quick, quick, let's solve the case while they're gone. <laughs> Von Forma de Karma. <laughs> I can't believe it. Von Karma's back. <laughs> Round two. <clears throat> let's see. One other thing that proves it wasn't him. Use their ID card. I'll press. Is that card hanging from your neck one of these ID cards? Uh, yes, sir! This card right next to my cuff, sir! There it is. <laughs> I keep it here so I won't ever forget it! What if someone were to steal it from you, keeping it out in the open like that? Maybe I shouldn't wear it around like that. Remember what I said to you out of three times the time gets stuck in my car door when I get up? Oh, the remaining time I get stuck. Oh, a hundred. 
100% of the time. <laughs> so you get stuck and get choked. <laughs> Maybe I just leave this one alone. At any rate, each police officer has only one ID card. The exception is Gumshoe, who keeps losing his. <laughs> Crunch. Uh, same brain. <laughs> uh, now. Oh, sorry, I forgot it was my line too. I was so focused on the pop school. <laughs> so working on the crunch. No, I was. I was just thinking about how much I wanted a pop school too, but I don't have any. <laughs> well, my crunchiness. <laughs> you did one crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Both the, the police department and the prosecutor's office can attest to this. Please proceed with your testimony. Let's see. My ID cards use a record of it. Yeah. I can use this card. Hmm. Didn't it? Did, did he? Uh, <coughs> Earlier, I, I believe you something testified. Up. Uh, what? <laughs> I think something's up. Hmm. Earlier, oh, I believe you testified that when you asked the man to show his ID card, he pulled a knife on you. Yes, sir! Show me any ID card, sir! So, don't you think that's odd? I mean, if he had his ID card, all I had to do was show it to you. There wouldn't be any reason to draw a knife. The knife is his <laughs> ID card. <laughs> Maybe you just panic. Oh, you know, when I panic, I too draw a knife on someone. <laughs> <laughs> Everything stems from contradictions, let's point them out. Can we take a peek at the court record? Yeah, I will, in a second. Mr. Wright, what do you think? I try not to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused. What? <clears throat> Problem with this ID card testimony is it's far too obvious. It's not like Edgeworth's have missed something like this. <laughs> is that a knife in your pocket? You just oh god, yeah, bet the knife. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a knife. You're thinking too hard about it. Come on, let's show them what we've got. Yeah. What do we got, Emma? I don't know. I'll <laughs> figure that one out. <laughs> uh, let's see. What do we have? We have Goodman's ID that was found somewhere else. At the crime That's scene. That's probably it. <laughs> How could you have used this if it was somewhere else? I yeah. So I uh, guess you have to present that on a different line? Um, yeah. Here... Ah, uh, here, probably. Yeah. Alright, hope and pray. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Wait one moment, Officer Meekins. I'm not good at waiting, sir! Neither am I! I have the victim's ID card right here. I found it at the crime scene. That makes sense. When I say crime scene, I'm not referring to the evidence room at the police department. I mean, the other crime scene. The underground parking lot at the prosecutor's office. Your Honor, I have one more piece of evidence to present. Th I do? <laughs> oh, that. <laughs> it's a very important clue regarding the victim's ID card. I bet I could have presented this as well, I think. Probably. One of those two things work. A lost item report? It's only half completed. But it shows that Detective Goodman had lost something on the day of the crime. Something important enough to fill out this report. Let me guess. You believe this something to be his ID card, right? I can't say for sure, but there's a high probability. Hehehe. <laughs> face. On the day of the crime, Detective Goodman was not carrying his card. <sighs> order! Order! So, now, what does this all mean? You can only mean one thing. It doesn't require much thought, thankfully. <laughs> The man Officer Meekins encountered in the evidence room was not Detective Goodman, but rather the man who stole his ID card. <laughs> Fuck if I know, Judge. <laughs> I don't know anything. Order! Order! Does the prosecution have a response? I have only one thing to say to the, de to the defense. Oh? Bravo, Mr. Wright. But bravo Allow me to summarize the defense's argument. Uh-oh. At 5.15pm on the day of the crime, 
the man Officer Meekins encountered. Uh -huh. Oh, oh! I thought there was more to that. Oh, there, there was. <laughs> In the evidence room was not Detective Goodman. There are two grounds to this to support this. First, the locker in the evidence room was already unlocked. Hmm. Second, the victim lost his ID card. Sorry, I was had to squint at that word. Yeah, those <laughs> yeah. fucking numbers. I know. <laughs> Am I correct so far, Mr. Wright? Um, yes. What's he up to? That being the case, we must inevitably arrive at a single conclusion. If the victim in this video is a fake, then the murder in the evidence room is also fake. In other words, the security camera does not show the incident of murder. I mean, it didn't really, anyways. Uh, th that is- uh, I, gu I guess that's right. Is something wrong, Mr. Wright? <laughs> I love it when they ask something wrong, Mr. Wright. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Every time. Phoenix, wrong. No! Only moments ago, you seemed, you seemed content to be pointing your finger around. Like this. Pew! Like ah! <laughs> <laughs> this isn't good. Uh-oh. He's thinking. Well, well. Seems you finally realized. Uh... Exactly what you've gone to such lengths to prove to wow. <laughs> exactly what you've gone through such lengths to prove. <laughs> Just the wow of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Explain yourself, Mr. Edgeworth. The defense has already done the explaining for me. The victim <laughs> in this video is is a fake, which means a murder did not take place. At the Wait. Yep. I'm just like. <laughs> hold, hold, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> uh. Mm. Now what's up with all the blood being there? Right? <laughs> There's so much blood on the scene of the crime. <laughs> so just carry like a bucket of blood and just splashed it on there. Like, alright, that works. <laughs> the at the police there. department at 5.15 on the day of the crime. So. so... So the real crime can only take place in one location, the underground parking lot. At the prosecutor's office, the murder being Miss Alana Sky, the defendant. The evidence is compelling. A trustworthy witness observed the moment that the defendant used the murder weapon. I don't know if you'd call her trustworthy. <laughs> yeah. I feel Why like I've been stabbed. Man's got some, uh... uh yeah. <laughs> yeah, Meekins is kind of leaning over. I knew that testimony was way too shabby. It was all a trap from the beginning! No! It's a trap! It's a trap! <laughs> so, <laughs> Mr. Wright, you've fallen into my trap card now! No! <laughs> the activity in the evidence room still leaves many questions unanswered. Who exactly was the victim Miss Officer Meekins encountered? And where did this person disappear to? However, this trial's purpose is to examine only the murder of Detective Goodman. Oh, fuck you. Just so, Your Honor. <laughs> Fucking bow. I love him. Mr. Wright, you have to do something, or else Lana. That truth be bringing out the Exodia. Now. What do I do? How am I supposed to get myself out of this mess? I'll just wait and see what happens. Alright, we'll just go home. <laughs> Let's go home. Back it up, we're leaving. One moment, your honor! What now, Mr. Wright? Don't tell me you're objecting to what you've just proven. Of course not. But I almost walked right into the prosecution's trap. Dude, you did walk into it. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is your problem? <laughs> this cross-examination has proven one thing and one thing only. The security video did not show the actual murder. Uh-huh. 
Uh huh. Where did he go, anyways? I don't remember where how he disappears that fast. I don't either. However, it cannot be said that it is unrelated to the murder in the parking lot. Oh. Specifically, large amounts of blood traces were found in the evidence room. The defense demands further examination of the truth of the matter. Mr. Edgeworth. Yes, Your Honor. If this court were to examine this further, other witnesses will be necessary. Is the prosecution prepared? I'm sorry, Your Honor. The prosecution considers the incident at the police department to be unrelated. We have not prepared any other witnesses for the incident. Hmm. Oh shit. Oh god, it's not. Oh god, oh fuck. This just okay. might be my chance! <laughs> Time to call a certain Texas Ranger to the stand. Oh god! Mr. Wright, do you mean... Your Honor, the defense would like to request a specific witness. Oh? Who do you have in mind? Someone we have reason to believe who knows the truth. The truth behind the activities that took place in the evidence room. Prosecution requests to hear this person's name. We I mean, could have waited two seconds before deciding whether or not to comply. <laughs> Think. Very well then, Mr. Wright. This person whom you would have testify. What is his or her name? Uh. uh Bruce no, Goodman. Everyone's <laughs> favorite cowboy, uh, Angel. Angel. <laughs> cowboy. <laughs> Got cowboy. it. Meekins again. <laughs> Mr. Cowboy is a link. <laughs> it shows up as a link in chat for me. <laughs> I don't even want to know where that leads to. It's just a website full of cowboys. Whoa. Officer Jake Marshall. Why him? I can't let him know everything just yet. He's in charge of the evidence room. I feel we should hear what he has to say. The prosecution agrees to the defense's request. Since he was responsible for guarding the room, we should hear his testimony. And his hamper was found- I mean, a cuff. <laughs> <laughs> Fortunately, he works in the police department. We shouldn't need longer than 20 minutes to prepare. 20 minutes? Well, very well. The court will take a 30 minute recess while the witness is sub subpoenaed. Never had to read that out loud. Subpoenaed? Subpoenaed? Yeah, subpoenaed. thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Just, I've only ever read it and heard it like a couple times, I never had to read it myself. It's a weird word. It's a weird word. Will the prosecution please prepare the witness during <laughs> this time? We will, Your Honor. Court in recess. Go play in the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> I call the tetherball. <laughs> That's February 24th. <laughs> Don't know what that means or anything. <laughs> How are we doing? I'm, I'm dying. We've been going for like two hours and 30 minutes. <laughs> according to the walkthrough, uh, this is the end of trial former. So. Ah. Like this recesses, so there should be like a to be continued after. Oh, okay. We'll just go until it says, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> if it doesn't, then you've lied to me and I hate you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> There's nothing stopping you, is there, Mr. Wright? Huh? What do you mean? You call for Jake Marshall. It seems you figured out everything. It seems you figured everything out. There you go. <laughs> uh, I haven't figured anything out. Anna, you're the one who knows everything. Emma, you always know everything. Why don't you just tell us? Mr. Wright is trying his hardest to protect you. I, I don't recall ever asking for his. Protection? How can you be so cold? 
No. Don't you trust us? Don't you trust me? Why don't you just cooperate? Everything would just be easier. That's true. <laughs> Hope I'm not interrupting anything, pals. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Himbo. Himbo. Oh, guess guess I am. <laughs> Dick busting through! <laughs> I guess I'll come back later! <laughs> oh, he slinks away! Aww. Oh, Detective Gumshoe, what is it? He slinks back! You got a lot of nerve, pal, making a detective run all around while on duty! And the top of that, you call me here! I've seen happier people at funerals! <laughs> Sorry, detective. You better be, pal. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> I didn't see you there, Miss Guy! <laughs> God. My voice. That's okay, so. Have you brought what I asked? Oh, 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 You mean this, right? <laughs> He's losing it. <laughs> My apologies, Detective, due to my present circumstances. <laughs> yes, I brought a gun! <laughs> bam, 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 bam! I was forced to use Mr. Wright's name while making my request. Ah, my name? <laughs> Never in a million years would I have thought it was you who asked me. Could I bother you to bring me the SL9 incident files? I'll need them by noon. Talk about crazy. SL9 incident? Lana, Dad. I thought Mr. Wright might need them, so I had them brought here. Hmm. Here, you might do well to read them. <laughs> Talk about a face journey. <laughs> Can't believe you, the chief prosecutor were a witness in that case. This guy was a witness? Oh. Oh, wait, I think I remember. Take it from me, you don't want anything to do with serial murderers. I don't want anything to do with serial murderers. Uh, now, what? <laughs> you get I was it. gonna make some joke about Ted Bundy. That is how to feel I can't even make myself do that. You can't even do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Now that I've brought you your stuff, you're gonna ignore me? Uh, Emma, but why? Why is your name in here? Oh. What? My name's in there? I don't know, unless... No, it couldn't be. L Lana, this SL9 incident, is that... That's the classification under the police filed it under. Or wow, I fucking... Uh, well, but... <laughs> two, <laughs> two years ago, the rest of the world knew it as... The... Job... <laughs> The oh, wait, killings. I remember. I remember, now. <laughs> I remember I, that name. Um, oh god. Oh, like it all just came flooding. <laughs> oh, dark. Oh. Just unlocked <laughs> dark memories. <laughs> <laughs> Both of us at the same time. Too dark. No. No, Lana. That's over with. No. Oh. Oh god. Emma, wait. She ran away. Uh, you know what? I just remembered. I, I gotta be somewhere. S sorry, pal, but I'm out of here. <laughs> Jake Marshall, Angel Star, Damon Gant, Miles Edgeworth. Not to mention Lana and Emma. Everyone involved in this case is connected to those killings two years ago. This can't just be a coincidence. Knowing you, you might just be able to figure it out. Time to get back to the shrine, Mr. Wright. Best of luck. Oh boy. Better take a good look at this file. Uh, no. uh, to be continued. Well, that's the end of that. <laughs> that's where we're stopping well, for today. Thank God we made it to a checkpoint, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna stop recording. That's the end of this episode. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, what a, a doozy.